Hello! Today we are going to make soft and delicious Chinese hot dog buns. First thing we will do is combine the sugar and the yeast into the warm milk, then set it aside to proof for 10 minutes. When the yeast is ready, it will look super soft and fluffy and foamy. Next, I'm going to combine the rest of the ingredients into a stand mixer, and everything can go in at the same time. Once everything is in, I'm going to set my mixer on the second lowest setting and let it mix for 20 minutes. The dough will be very sticky, and it will look like it will never come together, but after 20 minutes, it will have formed into a very soft and elastic ball. After 20 minutes, I'm going to use a spatula to gather the dough into a ball. I'm gonna cover it with plastic wrap and a plate, then I'm gonna set it aside to proof for one hour. Here we are after one hour and the dough will be very sticky, but don't worry because this just means that you're going to have super soft and fluffy buns. You can use hot dogs or sausages, whichever you want. Next, I'm going to transfer the dough from the bowl to a well-floured board and knead the dough for another two or three minutes. I want to make seven pretty big hot dog buns today, so I'm going to divide my dough into seven pieces. But if you have smaller hot dogs or sausages, you can divide the dough into 10 or 12 pieces. Once the dough is divided, I'm just going to make sure that they're all roughly the same size. If a ball seems too big, I just cut off a little piece and give it to a smaller dough ball. Once everything looks to be about roughly the same size, I take one ball at a time and roll it and stretch it to make a long piece of dough. The dough will want to shrink once you finish handling it, so roll it out longer than you think it needs to be. Once you have your dough rolls, you can start making your buns. It's super easy and really fun. You just take your hot dog and roll the dough around it. Once you get to the bottom, pinch the dough together to keep it from unraveling, then place it on a baking tray lined with parchment paper. Now you can just continue to make the rest of your hot dog buns. Once you've made all of your buns, set them aside to rise for another half hour. I usually put mine inside the oven with the light on to keep them warm and away from any drafts of wind. Half an hour later and look how fluffy they are. This is probably my favorite part of baking, seeing how fluffy and cute the dough looks after it rises. After the second rise, you can bake them right away, or if you like shiny buns like me, you can crack an egg to make an egg wash, then brush the egg wash over each bun. Make sure to do this lightly so that the buns don't deflate.
After the egg wash, the buns are ready to go into a preheated oven for 15 to 20 minutes. Make sure to keep an eye on your buns and when they turn golden brown, you know that they are done. And here we have our super delicious hot dog buns. The bread is so soft, fluffy, it's slightly sweet, and the hot dog is so delicious and savory. These buns make the perfect snack, especially if you pair it with tea or coffee, and I guarantee you won't be able to eat just one. If you're like me, you eat half of them in one sitting. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you again soon. Bye!